He's a long-time vaccine skeptic who Kennedy recently hired to head a study of immunizations and autism. Gaia and his dad, seen here moments after telling each other, I love you, <laughs> have published papers claiming vaccines increase the risk of autism, something that has been thoroughly debunked, as we've already walked through at length before on this show. Much of their research was conducted in what his dad called a world-class lab, every bit as good as anything at NIH, but apparently was in his house in a room that had wall-to-wall -wall carpeting and faux wood panelling. <laughs> Here is the two of them in that home lab. So, no red flags there, just two regular dudes knocking out experiments in what looks like a 1970s jack shack. <laughs> and their conclusions have been, shockingly, transparent bullshit. Guy's dad was often called to testify in court, and over the years, judges called his testimony, among other things, intellectually dishonest and, at best, negligent, if not a fraud on the court. In fact, by the time he died, his medical licences had been suspended or revoked in at least ten states. As for his son, that is luckily not a concern, because, fun fact, he was disciplined by Maryland regulators for practising medicine without a licence. <laughs> and, well, I do not know what the ideal qualifications are to run the nation's new inquiry into vaccines and autism. I'm assuming playing doctor for a while before getting caught isn't one of them. <laughs> not only is he not a doctor, he doesn't even play one on TV. 